Hi, when you're talking to someone in person, body language makes up a large part of your message. But as soon as you pick up the phone, body language becomes irrelevant. The success of your interaction depends almost entirely on your tone of voice and your choice of word. Hi, I'm Robert Mutumcha at Skills World Overseas Point. Today in next two minute video tidbits, I'm going to share 10 tricks for customer service over the phone. First trick would be answer the phone by saying hello or good morning. Often callers don't hear the first thing you say. If the first thing you say is your name, some people might not catch it. Smile. Yes, of course, the customer can't see you, but smiling gives your voice a more cheerful, enthusiastic tone. It also reminds you to be upbeat and positive. Sound enthusiastic. Try to maintain a positive attitude and let that come through in your voice. Say your name and your phone number clearly because people say things often, they tend to slur them. But these are the things that you need to say as clearly as possible. Avoid company jargons such as acronyms. Avoid technical terminology as much as possible. Some people may feel reluctant to ask you to explain a technical term because they don't want to seem like dummies. Stay alert to how the customer is responding. Does the customer sound confused, skeptical, unsatisfied? Don't use a speakerphone unless you're having a conference call. When you use a speakerphone, caller get the impression that you're too busy to give them your full attention. Say goodbye. Don't end the call abruptly. You will sound like you are trying to get rid of the customer. If you need to make notes about the call, do that right away. Don't rely on your memory to reproduce information accurately. Thanks for tuning in today. We have lots of easy take-home points about customer service in our world-class training modules. I will come back with more interesting topics every Monday. Till then, take care.